All right, so we're gonna work on the counter to the far toe scramble. There is a couple options, um, but I think the best one is really just trying to go far toe yourself, all right? You made the mistake, you let him beat your, your far ankle, so um, instead of trying to fight it, I think just go for the scramble, all right? So he, uh, I knocked him to his hip, say, right? He ends up getting my ankle down in this position, okay? The first thing I will try and do is I will try and kick my leg out, right? Don't go right for it. First, try, try your best to get your leg free, right? If you can turn and kick it free, do that. But if, if, he, if he has your toe realistically, right, like down there, even if I turn, it's really hard, okay? So what I'll do is this, right? Maybe, maybe he, I'll reach my hand out and start looking for his far toe. So I'm here, he gets to his knees, right? And now we both have equal position. So he used to have my far toe, and we were, I would say he was in an advantage position. Now we're in a 50-50 position where we both uh, can bump into each other and scramble from here, all right? Again, as I'm doing this, I had a couple options, but I'm really just looking to scramble, get him to his hip, get my leg free. Um, he can bump me down, but then I have his too, and I can bump him down. So it's kind of a battle there. Um, but it's better than you being stuck here, he's got your ankle, if you're just here with nothing, all right, you may feel like you have an advantage because you're on top of them, but right when you start trying to score, that's when they're gonna score on you, okay? So, the defense to the far toe is getting the far, far toe for yourself. So, one more time. You, you end up getting your ankle caught, you're like, you made that mistake, just reach out, start, as you start looking to score, grab his, get his. All right, now we're in a 50-50 position, all right? I can bump into him, I can try and scooch the corner here and come up here. Couple options, all right? 